quite the basketball conference. Fun to watch, fun to watch. The Big 12 championship rolled on at T-Mobile today with the remaining teams. Excuse me, right now the number's a little bit smaller. We're looking ahead to the semifinals. I'm Lauren Halifax. And I'm John Holt. Tonight, Cyclone and Wildcat fans packed the power and light in T-Mobile Center. It's Cat fans who leave disappointed. One less team as the Cyclones prevail. The Jayhawks went out yesterday. Tonight, Fox Force Jacob Sloan is live in the power and light district, which has been just crazy today, Jacob. John and the party's continuing tonight, like you said, for the Cyclones, but uh, K-Staters did show out today. In fact, we saw fans from pretty much every school, even some KU fans were here uh, cheering on their fellow Big 12 teams, but I'll tell you, most of the fans we saw were from north of the Missouri border. It's only three and a half hours from the T-Mobile Center to Iowa State's Hilton Coliseum. But the Cyclones haven't lost this year. We saw all wins, never saw a loss, and hopefully it's the same thing here at Hilton South. You heard that right. Cyclone fans call T-Mobile Center Hilton South. For alumni like Kale and Cole, coming to Kansas City for the tournament is a yearly tradition. Well, this is our trip here, and we're going to take it over when we're here. We'll run into dozens of people. The alumni are so connected, and yeah, it's, it's going to be a fun reunion here. One couple we talked to didn't know the tournament was in town this weekend. Guess where they're from? We traveled here from West Des Moines. We came for a birthday celebration, and we didn't realize all this was going on. This is awesome. Um, it's a big celebration for me. Even rival fans are here too. Iowans always stick together, right? So I root for a state unless we're playing them. K State fans we talked to said they were disappointed in the lack of purple in today's crowd. As for others, they weren't concerned. Yeah, you know what? Everyone's got to have a, a you know contingent, but we're always there. When it comes to the Big 12, it comes through EMA. That phrase, EMA, a Kansas State abbreviation for every man a wildcat, may not be true about this crowd. Now that crowd we saw was before the game. I will say I saw some pictures from inside the game. Look like a little bit more of an even crowd. Those Iowa State fans, I think they were going to stay all weekend anyway, but they play tomorrow against the winner, Lauren, of that Baylor-Cincinnati game that's happening at T-Mobile Center right now. We wish them the best. Jacob Sloan at Power & Light, thank you.